Hey guys, welcome back to the Bobby Brown Baseball Channel. All right, so today I have three unique drills to help you hitters with a short swing. These drills will involve using a bucket lid, a dog stick that will throw a ball, and a wiffle ball on a tee. So before we get started, I need to show you guys that when we're hitting, it's important that we have a nice short swing. In order to do that, we must tuck our elbow in, that's our back elbow right here, keep our hands pretty close to our chest right here, we do that we have a nice short swing or in a much stronger position to hit the ball much quicker position to hit the ball and this will allow you to get to the barrel to the back of the ball much easier opposed to what its coaches call casting out where our hands get a far away from our body the barrel goes first and we end up hitting it on the skinny part of the bat and sometimes we even roll our wrist over and hit it to the whole side of the field on the ground here's another angle right here back elbow stays tucked in hands close to the chest. My hands are inside this ball right now. This will allow me to get the barrel to the back of the ball. All right, so the first drill is not too difficult. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use my top hand, which for me being a left-handed hitter, this is my left hand, and I'm gonna get in my batting stance. My right hand can just go across my chest or can just be off to the side. I prefer to have it right here. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go through my regular stance. I'm gonna load, stride, and then I'm gonna go slow, tuck my elbow in, and then I'm gonna grab the ball all I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do it again. Stance, load, stride, elbows tucked in, grab the ball. Notice how I'm not going fast through this, I'm going slow. The whole point of this is to get your hitters to feel this position right here with the elbow staying tucked in. Important to note that I'm not standing too far away from the ball where I'm gonna to have to reach out. That's not the whole point of this drill. I must get pretty close to the plate, pretty close to the ball in order to accomplish this drill. I'll show you guys again. So when I'm getting in this position right here, I'm making a sideways triangle with both my arms. I'm tucking my elbow in, and then you'll see my front elbow here is going straight out, and then that's gonna go towards the ball when I'm swinging. All right, so bottom hand first, I'm gonna grab it with my palm facing down because when you guys are swinging and your bottom hand is going through the zone, it's gonna have the palm facing down and it's gonna be palm down at contact. So here I'm in my regular stance, I load, I stride, I'm gonna get my elbow out and I'm gonna throw the bucket lid straight. My whole goal is to throw it straight ahead. So again, it's gonna be stance, load, stride, elbow, throw. Stance, load, stride, elbow. All right, so now palm up for your top hand. So get in your regular stance and then you're gonna be tucking the elbow in, cross your side and then you're gonna release it straight ahead. Now notice how my arm is extending forward. So this last drill involves using this dog stick with the ball on the end. I'm not exactly sure what it's called exactly, but it's definitely a helpful tool when working on hitting. So the whole point of this one here is to try to make the ball go straight and I'm gonna snap my top hand forward forward center field, which in this case is right at the camera. So I'm gonna go knob first, pause for a second, and then I'm gonna snap my wrist and the ball should fly off going straight. Now, when I'm doing this, I don't want my hands to go away. I don't want my hands to cast out. I don't want my hands to go straight forward center field. Pause right here and snap the wrist. Pause, snap. All right, so you can definitely use a tennis ball on the end of this if you don't have a wiffle ball to use. So nevertheless, those are three unique drills to work on having a shorter swing, which is definitely very important. Work on all those three unique drills and you might find yourselves getting faster than you think. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please make sure you hit that like button down below, subscribe for future content, and remember, if I can overcome the bench, so can you.